Me and Rihanna Grounder was, man. Yes. You know what I'm saying? But but I, I, I told her, I told her, I told her this morning. So I'm not saying this because you're in the building. I told her, I said, Janae, we up for a war and you and Tony up for a war. I will be proud if you and him won a war over us because I feel like y'all song is more special because the love y'all share. And I love, love that song and I love the voice. And I told her off the break. I told her this morning. I said, I will be honored if y'all won that war over our, our war because our song has reached very special. We have performed very so. well, but y'all is it's like a connection because it's more realer. I think it's more realer because y'all actually in a relationship, you know. So you know, you don't know. <laughs> you quiet. You don't know. This grown folks talking. What? So today is in the building, man. How I feel, man? You drop your album, everybody buzzing, yeah, man. Yeah. I already got a cop on the plate. Yeah, they got that. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? We got our ass. You know what I'm saying? No, 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 Look at this. in the building, man, right there. It's my city, baby. We got it. We got it. She bought this car. Shout out. Huh? Give me a shout out. Say, Janae. Janae. Yeah. Yeah, it's in the building. Hey, look, we got CDs in the building, man. Wait. So, man, the kids in the building take all she the boys. Coffees, man. What? We got everybody going on. So, how I feel? What? It feels, you know what? It It's a lot of feelings. Um, I'm excited. I'm tired. <laughs> um, it's it's kind of numbing because you know how you work hard, so hard, right. long for something, and then you finally get there and you have anticipation of what it'll feel like. And it may not feel exactly like you thought, but I mean, I'm very happy. I'm very grateful, uh, humbled that I was able to get it done. I'm glad you, know, you got so. done. I've been waiting on this for like two years. Like, <laughs> right? We've been working. Yeah, since yeah you're right. Because I, I did out. six. Sexy Cool came out two years ago, uh, October seventh. So, and I'm so happy that um, the intro was DJ Swag. I can't wait. Oh yeah, my shout yeah, DJ brother Swag DJ Swag. He down in ATL. Yes, they much the love. Now. Yeah, big thing. So shout out to DJ Swag and shout out to Nancy because they was there from the um, from the know, jump. I'm yeah. to hit this number nine studio, mommy and me. <laughs> yeah, man, you want to yeah. talk about that? How was the experience with you? You being on your mother album? Hey, yes. Hey, you want to talk about it? Go ahead. I want to talk about the Oh, go my God. Hey, look, you got it. Hey, look, go ahead. Hey, look, go ahead. It's your time. Go ahead. Okay, everybody. My name is Mia, and my mommy's name is Janae. And I think... My mom is the best mom ever. Oh. And. Oh. <laughs> and I got I like the things he gives me. And I have my slime at home. <laughs> Your slime? What is that? It's like like the putty. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I, yeah. I had that when I was young. Mm -hmm. it's, it's green. How old are you? I'm six. No, him. Oh. No, you don't ask your father his age on <laughs> air. You don't do that. Yeah. I'm about to turn seven. Ah. And right. When's your birthday? November 18th. Oh, that's She's a Scorpio. Scorpio season. Well, it's February 18th. Yes. We know. February 10th. Okay. You gotta wait. She older than you. I am here. Number 18. I'm right behind you. Right, February 18th. So, How old is you? Oh, she's about to turn seven. Six. He's right behind you. So what? Check this out. Okay. So I heard. So I heard. I I'm heard you. You have a song coming out. Yes. So how you feeling about this song? Yes. I'm gonna be in the video. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, what? You don't know if I'm gonna be in the video? No. Work. I'm gonna be in the video. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> See, I'm in the video, y'all. Oh I'm in the video. He bribed that. <laughs> Wait, I'm in the video. You should be weird. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. All right. Wait. Wait. All right. What else you want to say? Come say. on. Come on, girl. Um. I'm. I'm. I love. I love the whole room new settings. And <laughs> yeah. Really. Oh my God! I'm loving this, man. That makes sense. It do and make sense. No, it don't. It do. And no, I don't. Go ahead. And I like the people who. Uh. You interview ready. I like the people who will be nice to me and who don't nice you be nice to me. I still like them and um <coughs> uh, 
Come on, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with him. Goodness I gracious. Thank everybody for what they done for me okay. and all the other children. Okay. Oh, Thank okay. you. Okay. That was okay. Do okay. okay. you even know how to spell children? Yes, I do. Hey, look. Hey, look. We're not going to have no beef with you. Yes, please. Please. Hey, look. That's easy to spell. Hey, look. Hey, look. Hey, look. Bam J and me is meeting each other for the first time. Oh my god. Hey look, oh hey look, it, it, they really like taking over. So I mean, I love hey me and you are really you are you are you are really intelligent and you are very interview ready. Look at her right there. You do so most interviews probably better than I can do. <laughs> she oh man. She she explained everything, man. So I mean this studio on mommy. So, hey, I know okay. I always say. Okay, always, hold on, hold on. Mommy on duty. Turn this off. Yeah. We're going to turn this off. Uh uh. Yeah. We're going to turn this off. And y'all going to chill out, okay? Yeah. Oh, see? Do not turn it on. Hey, look. Okay. So, this we going to do. <laughs> so, this we going to do, Janae. Janae yes. took over. She put the kids in time out. See, that's what we're going to do. Man. So, um, so I want to know is, like, how how do you um feel like like okay always say people say how you how you like all your songs your album I feel like I like all my albums right right you know right. what I'm saying mm -hmm. I feel like I like all my albums because they like my kids I love all of them I mm -hmm. love all my kids the same so if you had a favorite album that you want the world to hear the whole world to hear what would it be. On on this on the project, right? Um, you know what? I honestly would say the seventh. Which one? Good ones. Good ones. No, the, no, number not five. number seven. Number the se is it number five? Mm -hmm. Yeah, number number track number okay, five. Okay, five. The yeah, seventh. Yeah, five. yeah. I would okay. say that one. I would say that one. Right. So. I mean, I like you said. I, I'm very proud. You know, I, yeah. and and it's kind of selfish. Is, yeah, man, because I I I wanted because I have other songs. So I wanted to make sure the the mixture, the meshing, um, the different styles kind of mesh together. Um, though there's a variety of different sounds, I didn't. And see, really, um, I wanted to pay also simultaneously pay homage to my producers. Um, all the producers that I've worked with have a song on the CD. Each song is done by a different producer. I love my producers. Um, because their music brings out what's in me. So um, I just really wanted to make sure, and it's a few producers who have, have done more than one song with me, but I wanted to really just pay, uh, uh, and simultaneously pay homage to them as well. Um, but yeah, I don't, you know, bam, you know, I don't rush stuff. And right, I try yeah, to tell you know. people, you, you not, and I just did my, when I announced the CD release, I said, you're in no competition. There's no expiration date on success. You're in no competition right, right. with anybody. So make sure you do it right. I had to make sure my um, sound scan was correct, BDS was correct, sending my CDs to Nielsen so they can track it, you know, because it goes beyond BMI and ASCAP, and a lot of people don't understand that. So um, I wasn't just ready to put out anything. So the music had to be right. I had to go back. Shout, shout out to Bruce Gardner, my engineer. We had to retweak it and retweak it some more. And what the thing that I'm proudest about with this CD is you notice when you get the like official one, and I'll get that in a couple of weeks. There's no explicit label. Right. It's it's right. everybody can listen to it. Yeah, you know you don't what I'm cuss saying? That much. The only time you cuss really when you do songs with me. Yeah, you're a bad you influence, say, man. You <laughs> you're a bad influence. People always say, damn, I ain't never know they can Well, until like I that. fall. But I'm see, like, but you know, it's appropriate. No, I it's appropriation. It. It's appropriation. You know, I mean, I'm not. I'm right. not holier than that, you know, but right. it, so certain things, songs call for certain, you know, uh, uh, what do you call adjectives, so to speak. But for the most part, I know there's a way you can convey your message without, you know, all, all of that hey, all look, the time. Man, so. I, I, in my new projects, I always think about, I always think about you. I like, shit, I got to put your name on this. Language. Because, yeah. Children, I mean, children, I'm children in the room. But I be like, I, I be having to put your name on certain stuff. Be though, even some of the stuff that might not be in your lane, not on the hood type of level. But I feel like when I send you jumps with hooks, and I feel like I say, 
she can put her own yeah, stuff. Yeah, man, because she's going to be different. I'm going to tell you, until I fall, different. until I fall, did that. Because. <laughs> Yeah, if he was shocked, he was like, I was like, oh man, we gonna G-man, kill, murder G-G this truck. I said, Big G, man, it's gonna be the hottest break on the streets, man. You gotta mm-hmm. play. He said, just tonight. <laughs> he said, how you get him to do that? I said, man, I don't know. I sent it to him. I sent it to him. It's, it's the music. It's the music, and it's it's the vibe and the energy of the music. So um, that's that's really what pulls me in. But like the next joint you sent me. Um, not gonna stop. What we ain't gonna stop. Yeah, I like to see the video listen. already. <laughs> hey, look, when I heard that, when, I know you sent me that. And I don't Martha, talk, and I don't the, talk. The same, same dude that did that on Top Call me said, "Still, mm-hmm. you and Janae got to do this joke." And when I heard the hook, I said, "Janae is gonna put something to this that's gonna be real epic." So, man, we gonna put yeah, it together. Yeah, we gonna do it. Yeah, yeah. So, but um, yeah. So I mean, overall, just to sum it up, I'm I'm very proud of it. And as an artist, you know, we're we're too. we're selfish in the sense of. Um, like I said, you gotta like what you're doing, and you have to be happy with it. First and foremost, I mean, yeah, you trying to reach certain masses, certain people, but at the end of the day, you have to be happy with what you put out there. And so, I, I don't expect everybody to like it. You asked me what my favorite record was, or I'm gonna tell you straight up: the seventh. Either people gonna love it, or they are right. gonna hate it. Right. You know, but for me, it's it's it, but you know, but it's different. It's it's on some and I love pocket, it but it's on some pocket you stuff. Up. That's by me. Yeah. <laughs> like I be having youngers on the street, like bam, maybe she'll rap like this. Or I can't do that because I have to be true to what I'm true. I can't be with the generation coming in because I'm an old school dude, and I believe that message. Message in real talk, reality music is the way I need to go. I don't need to go. I don't need to lie to somebody just to set a record to come back. Right, so, exactly, uh, so exactly. I'm not going to do that. Right, so right. So I'm going to keep on in the message. I'm going to keep on putting the message out. I'm going to mm. keep on doing, doing what we do. And I like to say about, about, about you, and people always say sex sales, but that ain't what you do. If that ain't what you do, you got to still true to it because you're not trying to portray that image. You know what I'm saying? And that image is going to get you to where you need to be at. I'm Look, my whole, my whole thing is to each his own, and we all got to sleep at night. Whatever you do that allows you to sleep at night, that's your life, that's your walk. I, right. I don't have to succumb to uh, or conform to what everybody's doing. You know, that's that's never been me. You know, and so um, I will stay independent. That's I'm proud of that, too. You know, it's on I'm my really label. It's on Pumpkin Seed Entertainment. That's my own company. Before so, years. yeah. So it's it's kind of like I, I really like to make my own rules, and I don't do conforming well. You know, I don't do it at all. So to each his own. But as far as, you know, my whole brand about... Um, you know, the image you have, um, especially me having a daughter, um, you know, she can listen to this. She can watch right. my videos. You know right. what I'm saying? She can Google me and not see anything. And at the end of the day, that's who I'm really living for. So right. um, I'd be very, to me, I'd be very uh, self-conscious and somewhat embarrassed if she had to pull up some stuff. Like you see all these starlets who just do whatever, you know, they on reality TV. And they got kids, and I'm just like, well, you know, again, if you can sleep at night, that's on you. But for me, um, I have to answer outside of God. I look to her, you know, um, for a lot of validation and making sure that I'm on track with what I need to be doing. Man, that's that's a beautiful thing. And that's what I be on because I haven't been on the music grind in a minute because I've been doing a lot of hosting, and that's what I love to do. Mm -hmm. I made my... Mark and Hosting, I love to do, but people like you, Bello, Wincy, Los, Killer Cow, that reach out to me, like, man, you gotta get back to the studio and do something. So it, it really, it, it, it really makes, make, makes me feel good to see that you, because I've been begging for the album ever since I met you. <laughs> ever since I met you, I've been begging about, about this album, and we have done a like lot the, of everything, yeah, yeah. man. We've yeah. been in the studio, we've been at the video shoots from early in the morning, morning. all the mm-hmm. way to the evening. We mm-hmm. have, I go in my mother house, I see your picture <laughs> and me a picture on, on her refrigerator. And I was so, so glad. And I'm like, I love mama now. I'm like, mom, <laughs> where well, you catch your name? And she said, boy, I done went down there. Everybody was walking and went with your name and everything. Mm-hmm. And I love yeah. that my mother supported you. Your birthday is June 7th. The day my sister lost her life was June 7th. So I feel like 
I'm very glad. I'm so glad this album because when I first met you, it was at Go Go Radio. Right, right. Join DJ Rigo and know when they shout DJ right, Rigo. Right. Nigo, I mean, um, who that? DJ Swag. So you have done a lot of great things since then. I mean, the first song I heard from you. And I was mad you didn't the video was the um breathe. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Fabulous. And I paid attention to you. And like like I like how you grind. You never let what's going on bother you. I mean, you always take your time on every project what you do. I done came into the studio with you, you done had everything typed up. I'm like, damn, I ain't never seen person come to the studio with shit typed up. Someone is typed up. As dudes, as we, you know, we write our shit on paper, scribble, scrabble, or what we do. I mean, I did that originally, shit. but... She had her shit tight up. That shit like a document when she came. So, I mean, I was like, damn. So, she real certain about, like, we knocked out all things, man. When the bees in the trap um, was hot, we dropped the bees in the city. We came up with My World. Which, yeah, My, my, my world, world is yeah. a lot of inspiration on a lot of couples, man. Y'all cutting up back there, too, by the way. But, <laughs> but I mean, so what's the next video coming? I know we got our little um, video. You know, you know what? Out. Yeah, we're going. We're, yeah, I'm we're going to do. do, do my world. Um, I'm going to I do. I need to find me a supermodel though. <laughs> to do my. Part. Hey, start now. Uh, yeah, start I'm now, man. Uh, start now. Work. Um, the I think the next uh project that I'll be working on is going to be by my. He's my mentor, like my brother. Uh, Anthony Commodore of Malacom. Okay. He did. Um, he did. I'm not hurt. The I'm not hurt okay. video. And we've been talking about doing the good ones, which is on there. Um, the good ones is basically a song dedicated to my brothers. It's kind of like a pox. Keep your head I think up. I heard that one. But for the for my men. Well, for brother, thank you yeah. for doing something. So, they um, make us look bad on me. Yeah. Well, you know, you y'all y'all gotta act right too. So. We do uh, act right. <laughs> Not always making y'all look bad. Right. Exactly. So. Um, yeah, yeah, me, me. Okay. Um, so we gotta, uh, <laughs> so we gotta do that one. But that'll probably be the next visual uh, that I do with for for the album. And you know, a lot of things. See, everything. If if I could just give a little bit more advice, <laughs> you know, look to God for everything because, like, a lot. I I just went with what I felt. And you know, this few first few videos I did, they're not even on the CD. Right. They're not. They're singles. They're just singles. And and but for the some La La reason, yeah, La La. Um, I got a question. One, I yeah, got a question. Is not on the CD. But I got. Yeah. I got. That was one of the best joints. Go go joint. Yeah. But I got a. I got discernment to do visuals. I I try to hone in on what the spirit is telling me to do. And even though there's a formula, like oh, why are you doing a video if the song isn't on the track? Because I was I was told to. I believe in it. I think it will have more pertinency. It will have more um, um, potency if it's done visually, um, just versus it being on the CD. You know, so uh, that's that's kind of my was my method in in doing it. So um, yeah. Hi. Um, so Tiki, you got any words for Mrs. Day? I know y'all. <laughs> Right I'm proud of her, man. I, I mean, I'm, I'm serious. She be, I mean, got to be one of the hardest <laughs> women in the oh, DMV. Right. So I, I watch your videos, oh, you. follow your videos, and, and what you're doing. So she posts a video every morning. I try to. You won't get a ticket. <laughs> right, motivation. No, yeah. My, my phone sits on my windshield. And right. I, see, I hit start and, I <laughs> and go. Right. And you know, most yeah. of the time when I'm doing videos, I'm really speaking up for myself. I'm just sharing it with right, everybody. Right. Else, right. I'm self motivating myself. Exactly. Because, I mean, exactly. We all go through stuff. We all go through our ups and downs. But it's just you got to keep positivity doing, in mm -hmm. your life. You got to surround yourself with positive Peep people. Down. And you just got to have faith in everything that you're pushing for. And I respect everything that you just said <laughs> because you. You, you got that. You, yeah, you got that. Man. You see the vision. You got that. That that push from. Was being told to you and you were banging the word. Right, that's right. That. Yeah, and I'm proud of you. Thank too. you, I've been Tiki. You build yeah, for a few years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I've been yeah. You, so I'm, I can't wait to get to the car. Well, I, I appreciate y'all. <laughs> Me too, I'm gonna blast that jump right now. Like, hey, because <laughs> I, I love how you just like stay humble to you. I mean, I mean, stay humble to yourself. And I wanted to, I didn't want to. Bring you on to no race, even though I know mm -hmm. everybody was going to be listening. I said, Slim, I want you to come up here to talk about your album, talk about. I mean, I just wanted you to push people that you know that don't know about about Janae mm -hmm. 
because the who is Janae is such a movie because I feel like people don't know you, so I really right. want you. Right. Right. So well, let me let me let me let me interject too as far as the who is, and you mentioned and I'm humble. You know, a lot of things that people don't see is what I deal with with the MS. You know, I'm right, um, having right. multiple sclerosis. And the thing about it is I feel like as much as it bothers me and I'm in pain at times and all of that, I feel like um, that's God's way of humbling me. That's God's way of reminding me that I can do anything. I could take anything away from you. I can cause anything to happen to you. And um, it keeps me level headed. You know, so I don't I to me, I can't afford to. uh <laughs> That's just not in me anyway. You know that. Right, right, That's just right. not in me. I'm, I've never, even when I was young, I've never been a haughty type person or never. approachable or anything like that. You know, but um, I, you know, sometimes you have to thank God even for your circumstances, and because it's a reason behind it. And you know, we're Gemini, so right, for right. us, it's like we <laughs> get motivated through pain. Mm -hmm. I know yeah. I get motivated through pain, yeah. you know, so. Oh, you're July too, right? No. I, I your birthday. <laughs> oh, no, he on 4th of July. Hey, there she go. Come in. Uh, Come in. Hey, look, oh, mama, oh, mama's in here. Hey, look. Oh. Hey, this is mama. Uh, right. Hey, look. Uh, hey, we were, hey, look. Look, look. We were just. <laughs> hey, look. We were just talking about how. <laughs> How much my mother supports you. Like, I don't even know. Look, she gonna hug me and so. Because I told her. Why you get to a glass? Hey, mom, I told her. Look, I told. I, hey, look, I told my, my mother. I said, I walk in my mother's house. And I go get something to eat. And I look in the fridge. It's her and me right there. It's her and you right there. It's, it's other people. So, I mean, I'm, I'm just. Like proud of the way that my mother has supported you. I mean, for real. Who? Oh yeah, my sister's number one ball player. She, hey, look, I'm gonna bust your ass. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Hood Rose got her video coming. Out. I can't wait. Okay, so Hood, okay. Hood Rose did her, her okay, video too. Okay. So I mean, everybody, everybody be doing. My sister's number one ball player. I'm gonna take her on that court and bust her for that video <laughs> and record on live, and then we gonna. Do it like this. She so looking like, like, yeah, whatever. Hey, she's over there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, right, uh, she right. talking much trash. <laughs> she put up the money, man. Mom dudes in the building. <laughs> so, man, right. now, here, mom. Hey, look, mom, I'm going to come to this and record you because I know she wanted this, John Gordon. Yes. Her so so I'm gonna get this to her and then I'm gonna go oh, in there and you. get mine. So I know she wanna blast your name while she cleaned up. So thank you. you know what I'm saying? So everything we we good. So yes, I mean what's yes. the next thing? Well, other than the video, um I'm working on actually I wanna hone in my energies onto Mia. Um, right. You know, I kind of want to take a step back. I'm not quitting, but I want to take a step back. That's and, what I want to um, do after this album, too. Just kind of put everything into whatever God-given ability she has. Right. Um, because I've done this for so long. And, again, I'm not quitting, but at the same time, it's kind of like you got to listen to when God tells you back off. And um, so... I just, you know, when it calls me, I'll be there, you know. Right. But actually, I also want to work on a, a screenplay, and I want to um, work on, she has some artwork. We might do some t-shirts with her designs, get them trademarked. I'm trying to raise a boss. There you go. I don't right. want to raise a an employee, <laughs> right. you know, and um, that has to start kind of at this age. So I want to take everything God's given me and just funnel it into whatever. I support her with whatever she wants to do. She doesn't have to do music. She's used to it because she's always with me. Right. But if she wants to be a, she loves science, you know, she wants to be an engineer, that's fine. She can do whatever she wants as long as it's productive. <laughs> Boy. As long as it's productive. Boss, so is that boss not an employee? Because baby. you know what, we weren't. And I'm no for no offense. I love my parents are the world to me, but I think it's generation. Sometimes they didn't really. It's more get a good job, go to college, do that, and now look at the state we in. And I mean, I'm hey, I got my degree. I mean, I'm, I'm saying whatever works for whomever. But at the end of the day, my dad was an entrepreneur for thirty something years. I saw the freedoms he had. I'm still striving to do it with this. But no one ever put those seeds into me early. So I'm going to do it, and we're going to see what fruit grows out, out of out of whatever she it's wants so to do. It's so important to do that, too, because if you don't, then you're stuck in the job. Exactly. Once you get stuck in it, it's so hard to get and out. And then you're kind of like, oh, my God, I got to have yeah. benefits. I have to. I, I'm struggling with that now, you know. But And they say take a leap of faith, but it's like, okay, I, I know God is in control, but 
if look, if I was by myself, I would have been left where I'm at because it's just me. But when the things are the way they are, I got to make sure she's covered. So it's a little harder. But um, so I said, well, you know what, God, what I do is I just put it into her now so that she can grow into that phase and not have to depend on the man or whomever uh, punching the clock. So, but I tell her, though, when you have your own business, the difference is you're going to have to work more hours, but you'll love what you do. So it won't seem like it, you know, but you're going to have to put the work in. Exactly. It, right. You're building your own legacy. You're building your own legacy and your own wealth, you know, and it's not about being rich. Rich ain't nothing. You want wealth that'll last for legacies, you know, and last generations. So that's what I'm trying to do with her, you know. So, yeah, yeah. So. I just, I just my job. Yeah. 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 I mean, I mean, my was, I mean, my shit was high. I had an asthma attack, and I come in. I'm lucky. I'm in the hospital. I'm like this. Yeah, yeah. Guess who? I was like, it's Tiki. She like, damn, what you doing here? I'm like, God damn, I ain't believe you. Language. Yeah. yeah. I know. I'm, but I'm, he I'm, says like, you ain't going to let me stop him at work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, so hey, look, we gonna let Janae get out of here. I know you had yeah. a show that was yeah. happy with you. We gotta get DC so, gutter. We gonna get one more because this gonna be a deep conversation, my mother. I'm, 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 okay. I'm so, oh God, I'm, I'm so, I'm, I'm, I'm so happy. I love my mother. Me and me and my mother have went through some oh hard times. <laughs> But she I'm always glad. react like that. Yeah, that's what I'm glad. And, you know, it's true. And I know. Then, mama. My mom had called up one of his time. That's why people don't understand why I stand Big G the way I do because he was the one that called me and said, man, until you get right with your mother, I can't really. Yeah, I, I can't remember really something with you right, right. Because right. you have to do that because I know my mother to blame me. His mother had blamed me for, for some stuff that happened to him. You know, all his mm -hmm. brothers, he's the, like the last brother. All his brothers got killed like he's the last brother. So, mm -hmm. Yeah. And Big G, he loved my mother, man. He loved, mm -hmm. he loved my mother like his mother. I so, love her too. So it's all a good thing, man. <laughs> we about to play one Janae track. Let's get out of here. What song? Fun. Which one y'all playing? I'm, I'm, I'm curious to know. What, what, what you want to play? Um, you don't do the seven? You don't do the seven? It's we don't have a oh, you have, oh, you can't load it up no, right now? Oh, okay. okay. Well, we got guys sexy cool. It's okay, that's fine. Brand. That's fine. The video is blazing. Yes. 23,000 views and more. I mean, okay. it's a... Is it good, good? You want to play good ones? <gasps> yeah. Do you have that? Yeah, yeah let, okay, let's play well, the good we, ones. Okay, we Because you haven't really one. heard that one. So. And, uh, um, we can play, play the good ones. And, man, I want everybody to know. Shout out to my man, Big G. He just dropped that Patrick Ewing shoe. Mm -hmm. He has his own shoe, so everybody go get it. Downtown. Yeah, I'm going there. I'm about to go buy it before I buy some phone. Right, right, exactly. I'm going to buy it over to support the home team. That's right. So go ahead. Okay, well, well, thank you guys for tuning in. This is Janae. Y'all can follow me at everything at, at who is Janae. Um, thank you guys for having me. This is my first interview since the CD release, so I'm very honored right. that you asked me out here. Of course. Um, but I want you to play the good ones, which again is kind of like a, a Tupac version of uh, "Keep Your Head Up" for the women. I'm supporting the like, men. Stop, um, stop. Yeah, I mean seriously, it's a cycle. It's a cycle, but you gotta act right. You gotta act right. <laughs> I mean, you not you. Look, look. I heard. I heard. This is as simple as it. If you want a king, a queen, you gotta be treat. Be act like a king, and if you want a king yeah, you gotta act like a queen so yeah. it goes both ways but this is my tribute to my men i love my brothers uncles yeah, right. fathers everybody rest in peace to my daddy he was a good yeah. man yeah. so hopefully you guys enjoy this but this is my tribute to my men she to the real man, the good man, that lies <laughs> just this way. Let's go.